They were two teams going in the opposite direction. The Rangers, after winning their first three games, have dropped five straight. As for the Orioles, they've been solid through and through, winning six of their first eight games. And Ian Kinsler would have the game of his life. He hit, ran, and just played like Jackie Robinson, the man all of baseball was honoring on Wednesday. Bottom of the first, down 2 nothing. Josh Hamilton strokes one to center field. Ian Kinsler scores the first of his five runs on the day. Rangers down 2-1. Bottom of the second, Ty Wigginton. The great play robs Marlon Bird, who for not that play would have gone 6-for-6. Six six. Bottom of the second, Mark Hendrickson taking one away from Jared Sotolamaki. And bottom of the third, nobody's going to catch this one. Ian Kinsler up, out, and gone. Third home run of the season, Rangers down 3-2. Still in the third, Hank Blaylock. The seeing eye single to right, Hamilton touches down, game tied at three apiece. Bottom of the fourth, it's Marlon Bird turning one around. Andrew Jones is going to score. Rangers up 4-3. Bottom of the fourth, bases loaded for Nelson Cruz, and what a year this guy's happened. Drives one to right center field, his fifth home run of the season. That's a grand slam. Kinsler needed just a triple, the hardest one of all the ones in the cycle to get, and he would get it in the sixth. Kinsler sends it to right center field. What do you think? Heading all the way back there. Can he get that triple? He's got it. The fourth Ranger to hit for the cycle is Ian Kinsler. <laughs> this was all Rangers all the time. They pound out 19 runs on 19 hits. Chris Benson, who missed the last two years because of rotator cuff injuries, gets his first win since September 21st of 2006.